Soldier boy, tell him. Koala. Oh, yeah. Oh, Soldier boy, oh, tell him. Y'all know what it is, man. Turn my swag on, man. Tap me in my bird. What's up, guys? Um, I got a couple recaps. I'm doing this on uh, my tripod. I bought this tripod on eBay. It's a 50 inch tripod. I got it for like 10 bucks delivered with shipping. So, um, I might try out a few different like angles or whatever for my next few videos. But right now I got the JS Sobe angle. But I got a couple boxes at my shop 06, 07 SPX basketball and then this 08 X baseball. Uh, I opened them there. I'm just going to show you what I got. I'll do the SPX first. Um, SPX, I got a bunch of SP excitements. Number to twenty nine ninety nine. Nobody really cares. Yeah, a couple no name rookies, um, which is uh, pretty gay. Uh, um, my four hits were um, I got this Danny Granger dual jersey, um, Cedric Simmons autograph dual rookie jersey, and then this uh, Zach Randolph and Jawan Dixon. Duel. That's sweet right there for Walker. And then I guess the hit of the box was this uh, Magic Johnson Flashback Fabrics. It's pretty sweet. I mean, it wasn't the greatest box, but that's that's a pretty kick-ass card. I like that. So that was that. And then the uh, X Baseball. Um, you get five Yankee Stadium Legacy cards. Um, you get a bunch of inserts. Um, there's actually only one insert set, and it's called Exponential. But they do it like Exponential 1, Exponential 2, Exponential 3, Exponential 4. You know, 4 being the rarest or whatever. But the Exponential 1s are red and they look like that. It's stupid. This, this, this product reminds me of like Special FX Baseball, except without like the crappy autographs. <laughs> um, although my autographs weren't great. <laughs> Here's the Exponential 2s. They're like black. And then the 3s. My opinion, 3 looks the best. Um, it's like gold. They're really cool, kind of. And then here's four. I got a Guerrero. I only got one four. But, um, oh, and I also got this Jeter Exponential One for my PC. Um, uh, you get two autographs, and my autos were Kevin Hart for the Cubs. I don't really know who he is, but, um, I'm gonna look at him up, see what his stuff goes for. And then I got a Marlon Bird for the Rangers autograph. Uh, and I actually got a third autograph. Um, it was a, say, it come it came in this penny sleeve, and it's Yankee Stadium Legacy buybacks. But it kind of doesn't make sense because it's not really Yankee Stadium Legacy. It's Yankee Signature Series. <laughs> Sam McDowell autograph for my PC. So that's pretty sweet. This was like 2004, I believe. I think, or it was 03 Yankee Stadium, or Yankee Signature Series. So, that was a cool little extra for my PC, you know. Um, you also get, um, you get these in every pack. They're not, uh, they're not, they're basically just like base cards. Uh, they look exactly like the base cards, except they're like die cuts. But, um, yeah, they're just, whatever. They're just like base cards. They try to make it look like a die cut, but... You get so many of them that they're really worthless. <laughs> um, and then you get four rookie cards per box, and then you get two of the X die cut rookies per box. And I did really good with the rookies. I got Fukudome, Clay Buckholtz, Ian Kennedy, and Evan Longoria. And then my two die cuts were Longoria and Ian Kennedy. So <laughs> overall, I did pretty good with the. I got two Longorias, two Kennedys. You know, overall pretty good with the rookies, but. Uh, I don't really recommend that product. It's it's kind of really weak, um, my opinion. It's just full of inserts and no numbers or nothing. It's just I don't know whatever. So that's about it, guys. Peace.